damn it. Son of a bitch still has Lily. And now I'm back to square one again. We've re-established contact with the Marker Agent Kidman. About time. Patch him through. Sebastian? Sebastian, are you there? Kidman. Finally. Are you all right? That psycho is still on the loose in here. I turned on the emitter, and that seemed to slow him down. But he got away. And he's got Lily. She must be so scared and alone. Uh, I've got to find her before he does something terrible to her. I'm so close. I can feel it. We want to find her just as much as you do, Sebastian. Yeah, sure you do. Don't want your precious experiment to fail. It would be a real tragedy to waste all that time and money. I was speaking for myself, not Mobius. I spent a lot of time with Lily during testing. She's a good kid. I don't want her to suffer. I know things are bad, but I have faith in you. You've got to stay focused so we can save her. Together. Yeah. Okay, you're right. Thanks for the pep talk, Kidman. Thanks. Gotta figure out where he took her. I think I might have just figured it out. Not doing a very good job of hiding. It's almost as if he's taunting me. Well, if it's a fight he wants, he's gonna get it. I just have to find my way there. O'Neill, it's me. I see the stable field emitter is back online. Please tell me you found the core and you're on your way back here. Sorry. That lunatic still has her. But I think I have an idea of where he went. Yeah, I see it too. I'm picking up the signal again, but now it's coming from the theater in the other part of town. Right. Through the marrow again, I guess. May need a little guidance here. I'm on it. Looks like turning the emitter back on stabilized some passages there. Exit D5 looks to be the one closest to the theater. I'm not totally sure what you'll encounter down there, so watch your back. At this point, nothing would surprise me.
This must be the passage O'Neill was talking about. with my mind. this stuff. Stop and listen to yourself, Myra. A secret society abducted Lily and staged her death? Do you realize how crazy that sounds? But it's true! Sneak past it. I gotta get the hell out of here.
I thought this place was supposed to be fucking stable. Someone's been watching. Lily. Whoever's been here was gathering data on her. Don't move. You're Mobius, right? I- Shut up! <clears throat> Don't say a word. You're not one of us. No, I'm not. Kidman sent me. Look, I'm here to help, okay? My name is Sebastian Castellanos. You're lying. Sebastian Castellanos is dead. What? No. Who told you that? Turn around. Do it slow. You're Yukiko Hoffman. How do you know my name? I told you. They sent me in here to find my daughter, Lily. The core. I'm telling you the truth. I know. You do? Lack of micro-expressions and deflection. No verbal parroting. I've seen enough to know you're telling the truth. Right. The team psychologist. I have to use whatever tools I have to survive. Combat isn't my forte. Seems to be a running theme here. Sorry for pointing my gun at you. So they're sending independent contractors now? That means things aren't in I have, but the only one I've found alive is O'Neill. Liam is alive? Good. Has he made any progress on stabilization? The big emitter's back on, but this place is still falling apart, and I think it's all because of this psycho that kidnapped Lily. He's running loose in Union, and can manipulate this place at will. That means my theory is correct. This is more than a core disconnect. We doctors don't like to use the term psycho in pejorative terms. But in this case, it's apropos. Only a clinically diagnosed psychopath could affect STEM like this. A psychopathic personality type using Lily to amplify his power. This is the worst possible situation. You're a shrink. Any suggestions on how to defeat him? Psychopaths are antisocial, lack empathy, and exhibit sadistic tendencies. But their main commonality is their pathologic egocentricity. They don't care about people, only themselves. Can you think of anything that would be important to him? Yeah. He thinks he's some sort of artist. It's all he talks about. Then maybe the best way to attack him would be through his art. Destroying something valuable to him could knock him off of his guard. I'll keep that in mind. He's holed himself up in the th- Right. So exit D5 then. It's right here. Just in the next room. Let's pair. I'll review. I still regard. Feel free. So does Lily really think I'm dead? Sorry to break it to you. But she does. I thought it was the truth, too. Until just now. But over the years, I've learned to take everything Mobius tells me. It wasn't difficult to see you Why would they do that? I know it's not right. Lily is probably less traumatized by thinking you're dead than by thinking you're alive. Yeah. Maybe. Don't worry. If Mobius knew to keep psychopaths out of STEM, then how did one end up in here? I don't know. Every individual in STEM was subjected to a battery of psychological exams prior And we've been observing them from here. Yeah. Unfortunately, psychopathy, psychopaths tend to be cunning and highly intelligent. Aware of their own diagnosis, they're able to disguise themselves among us. The fact that this one was able to fool us, he's obviously adroit and self-aware. Disturbingly so. Great. So the tests only filtered out the weakest of psychos. I feel terribly responsible for all of this. I helped devise those tests. You 
you said you think there's something more to this? I studied the Beacon incident extensively so that we could avoid another disaster like that. In that case, the person in question was the core. But even then, the environment remained relatively intact. Something just doesn't seem right here. What do you mean? The creatures in here. The dissolution of Union. The total breakdown in communication with Mobius. It just seems like a lot for one person. He meant... I couldn't... What? There's only one, but I need to... The theater. I'm coming for you. these things about damn it lily's inside there you did not appreciate my beautiful obscurus performance perhaps this one is more to your liking listen no sorry help me i'm preparing my greatest work yet but you are not worthy enough to witness it. Not until you learn to respect my art. Listen. Listen to their screams. The echoes of my work. Respect art, huh? Time to put Hoffman's theory to the test.
Sounds like someone's in trouble. So this is his art? It's just a photo. I'm gonna stab the shit out of you. or something. This should get me close to that art. Shit. Maybe I can sneak by it.
Hopefully I'm done with those things for a while. about destroying these things. Destroying that freak's work was actually therapeutic, but I'm not done yet. One more. Let's finish this. than clay, softer than marble. It really is the perfect medium. Oh, I can't concentrate like this. A sculpture doesn't need a tongue. Ah! <laughs> 
Jesus. That's both of them. Should have done the trick. Better head back to the theater and see if I can get in.
He's got to be in here somewhere. You dare to destroy my work? You expect me to bend to your will? Just like them, thinking they could sculpt me into what I am not. What they created in here, it's marvelous. They wasted it because they had no imagination. Because they are not artists. They want to control me, manipulate me. You want to stop me, but you have failed. Because with the power of the core, I can create my art forever. This chase has been entertaining. But even the greatest entertainments must come to an end. The girl! Where is she? I commend you for making it this far. If perseverance were an art form, you would be a master. Perhaps not Michelangelo, but a Van Gogh at the Enough very least. art school bullshit! Where is she? The core is safe with me. I took her on his orders. But once I realized the extent of her powers, how could I possibly hand her over? What I'm doing is more important than mere personal gain. He could never understand this. He? Who is he? It doesn't matter. He won't be around much longer. My work, however, will continue. <laughs> Picasso had his blue period. I have entered my crimson period. Shit! No! Don't! Behold, my latest creation. No! Sick bastard! How will I ever top this? I'll find a way. Her fear is always inspiring. <clears throat> Nothing like the corruption of innocence to spark the fire of creation. You would do nothing with her power. You are an uncomprehending animal. She's useless in your hands. I'm coming for you, asshole.
Where the fuck did you go?